today I'm going to talk about something kind of sad to me, which is the end of The Walking Dead game for good. It makes me very sad because this is one of the games that like made me the gamer that I am today. It's one of my all-time favorites and Clementine is my hero and I just can't believe that it's over. Um, if you didn't know, Telltale kind of disbanded, so it was kind of iffy if we were even going to get an end to uh, Clementine's story, but luckily Skybound Entertainment stepped in and we did get an end. And while some of it wasn't really what I was expecting or wanted, it was still a really great ending to the series. Um, one of my only complaints, honestly, about the season in general is that I really didn't care that much about AJ. Like, it. I know they were kind of trying to mirror the relationship between Clementine and Lee, but it just, I just didn't feel it. Like, obviously, I didn't want anything bad to happen to him or Clementine, and I knew that she would be upset if anything bad happened to him, but I just didn't feel for him the way that I felt for Clem when Clem was that age. And I don't know if that's a fault of the series or just because you really can't mirror as great of a relationship as Lee and Clementine had. It's probably it because it's not like AJ and Clem's relationship is badly written or anything. It's just, it's no Clementine and Lee. Nothing will ever measure up to that. But um, the previous episode left off... The previous episode left off with like a big explosion or whatever so you get to see the aftermath. Math. So you get to see the aftermath of that, and you kind of get to see how you've treated AJ throughout the season, like, will affect him now, and I'm not completely happy with how my choices affected him. I thought it was kind of silly at some points. Like, I get it, but, like, I some of the choices I made I never knew would make AJ into that kind of person, but I guess that's kind of the point of the series is that you never know what your conversational decisions or regular choices will do to a character or a relationship. But overall, like, I thought it was a good ending. There was definitely a point where I was freaking pissed off as shit, which when you get to that part, let me know, because you'll know what part I'm talking about. They totally, 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 totally freaked me out. <sighs> but anyways, I'm just really upset that it's over. I'm really, really upset because it's been a huge part of my life for, like, five years now. I didn't start playing it until uh, the second season was out, so I played the first season, but I didn't start playing it until the sec second season was almost done. But it's just been such a huge part of my life for five years. I've cosplayed as Clementine. I, in my cosplay, did a video where I sang one of the songs from the game. I have a signed picture of Clementine. I have a signed postcard of Clementine. I have a a painting of Clementine. Like, it's a huge part of my life. Oh, I also have a Still Not Bitten bracelet. Um, it's just, it's been a huge part of my life, and I'm really sad that it's over. But seriously, though, if you haven't played the final episode, you should. It does a pretty good job at wrapping up Clementine's story as a whole, and I think you'll like it. 